Appalachian Wireless now has new forward pay pricing, where you can pay up front and get the data and features you desire. Five gigabytes of data, just $39.99. Unlimited, just $79.99. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. Yesterday, teachers from across the state marched on the state capitol in Frankfort to protest actions taken by the legislature. Today, at schools around the region, it was the students' turn as they walked out of class in a show of solidarity with their instructors. I spoke with students and teachers at one school in Floyd County about the demonstration. Here's what they had to say. Uh, we heard uh, that you know there would be school and uh, it was sort of confusing at first, you know, we weren't sure if uh, every teacher would be there or not. Uh, but we all collectively as students decided it's not okay. You know, what's going on, uh, it's, it's just not okay. They would fight for us and it was our turn to show our love and affection towards them and support them in any way that we can possibly do. I think uh, the root of all the issues is people don't know how to talk and compromise and show empathy towards others. And that's what we need to work on. That's what Matt Bevan, the governor, needs to work on. He needs to acknowledge these voices that are uh, voicing their uh, opinion about all this situation. And he needs to listen. We all sort of got into a big group and collectively decided that we're going to, uh, to sort of, you know, rebel and uh, leave second period and uh, ended up in the gym and to our surprise it was a lot more in support than what we thought. I really sincerely thought as a teacher that a lot of kids were just going to do it to get out of class. I mean if I'm just being completely transparent with you and so uh, one of the stragglers who's one of my students you know he put his arm around me and he said you know last night some of us were talking we thought we can get this done we can show our support for teachers. It was such an affirming experience to have that kind of support from your peers, but also the kids and the sincerity of it. I would tell them that this is wrong, but I could also see why, why because there ain't no money left, but education, it shouldn't be the first thing they think to cut off the list. And teachers have been nothing but respectful at this point. That we have, they have executed their right of peaceful protest perfectly. And instead of respectful uh, comments back, they get called thugs, or yeah. they're being childish, or that they're after money. And that's not it at all. Reporting from Floyd Central High School, I'm Ralph Davis for EKB News.